Hey there, everybody. Fet here, and welcome back to Fet Plays Going Medieval. You know, I wonder. Settlers' wounds need tending. It's cold. I, I get it. I wonder. Would it be worth it to put a a heat source in here? It's been suggested, and you know that's part of why I'm doing it. But I mean, I don't know. It might not do anything. That's that's my concern. But. You know, I, I can give it a shot. You know, like, there's no harm in putting one here. It won't be in anyone's way. I guess I could put one here for the same reason. I, obviously, I'm not going to put them upstairs. That just seems absolutely useless. But, you know, it, it might be worth it to have some heat right here. Because technically, if you don't have anything selected, it's under a roof. So who knows? You know, worst case scenario, it still gives lighting. You know? Yeah, it's still actually colder around here than it is... Yeah. So, not much done. I'm not too surprised. But it was worth an experiment, you know? Plus, they look nice. You can't deny that. They do look nice. All right, I'm almost tempted to bust down a segment of wall just so I can put in some flags over here. Actually, no. I don't need to do that. Because I can just put the flags... Up here, can't I? You can't reach that, but you can stand right here on the Merlon, can't you? I'd have figured you could stand on the Merlon and build that there. Huh. Well, that's unfortunate. What if we take out the Merlon? Just temporarily, of course. Okay. You can't stand there and build... Alright, whatever. You know what? You're gonna make me do this the hard way? You're gonna make me do this the hard way. What can I say? Uh, why would I waste brick on this? You know what? This won't be scary at all. Just build it out of wicker. <laughs> yeah, this is fine. And actually, we could keep the Merlons there now that I think about it. Because of the way we're doing it. Merlons could stay. We just build temporary wicker flooring out there. Stand on it. Build what we need to build and then go away. It's dumb, but I like it. Okay, now you can reach... Well, not quite yet. There. Now you can reach there and build that. Okay. That's really dumb, but it works, damn it. Oh, mercy. Javis, turn 44. Uh-oh. A ferocious swarm of wolves. Have arrived in Oh, that is a big swarm. That is 17 wolves. I think we got doors. Oh my goodness. Uh hey, speaking of. Let's go ahead and lock these three doors. Keep us in. Because that's a lot of wolves. Yeah, and they're they're just running around killing other wolves. Oh gosh, they're out here myrtleizing everything. Jeez. Maybe maybe we do something about them. Uh, Vasilla, Dale, Carl, Parrish, Jeva. All of you. Dra Ooh, wrong button. Draft up. Get up here. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, get these wolves. Alright. Why don't you just head over here? There you go. There you go. Shoot him as you can. I know the crossbows are going to have better luck. But I mean, you know, we're doing what we can over here. Actually, what we could do is bait them. Um, Sibley, you do have good armor, but you're getting resources. Someone, Melody, you also have good armor. Yeah, get over, get over here. Come here. Okay. Temporarily open this door. Come over. Come over here. Oh, right, we have to have someone actually... We gotta wait for someone to open it. Someone open the door! Melody, you open the door then. Rick. Uh, change this door setting. And then walk out. Okay. Come on, you stinky wolves! You make yourself tough. Don't you? At least some of you think you're tough? No, Alright, I'm going home now. 
Uh, okay, let's just grab the ones with the bows. We can see who's not shooting. It's pretty darn easy. Head down here. Do this the hard way if we gotta. Alright. Uh, Bail, what are you doing? Oh, I know what you're doing. You're trying to get the stuff. I see what you're doing. That's okay. We got plenty of hunters out here ready to take on these wolves. And it looks like they're dispersing. Alright, they're done. Good job. Okay, go ahead and open all these up. We're fine. We're good to go. Life's feeling alright. Okay. Yo, why are we... Oh, no, that's the Merlon. I was going to say, why are we rebuilding the wall? No, that's just the Merlon, right? Yeah, that's the Merlon. I don't know why we have to have a scaffold as big as a wall for it. But that's all right, I guess. Merchant Caravan. Now we're talking my language. What's up, Stanley? You and your merchants. How y'all doing? Hope you're doing well. And I guess I could do the same thing here. I mean, it's not like we can build this out here right now. Or maybe we can. I don't know anymore. Can you walk there? Yeah! Hey! hey. Look at that. Because I, what I want to do, I don't, I, I don't think this will work, but I'm going to try it anyway. I want to put a shield here. Yeah, you can't actually go out there. So, deconstruct this window, build the two shields, and we'll put it back. It's all about that branding, you know? You got to get that branding going on. That way everyone knows who you are. Before, otherwise, they'll forget. You wouldn't want them to forget, would you? Okay. No, you wouldn't. It's going to answer that question for you right now. That's why you put a couple of extra large banners outside. You know? Boom. All right, now we can build the shields. Sweet. What's up with this Merlon? I don't get it. Who are you guys with, by the way, Stanley? Uh, Faithful Sons of England. They don't like us that much. Maybe we can give them some food. No, wait. It's winter. We can't give any food away. Oh, we really can't give any food away. We actually have more um, meals than we have raw food. And that doesn't happen very often. Probably means we need to do more hunting. There's more wolves out here to catch. So let's, let's go get them if we can. I mean, there's one wolf. Apparently. He's probably hungry. He's probably not that big. Okay, there's some rabbits at least. Oh, there, there they all are. Okay, there's all the animals. Never mind, we're good. Uh, we're, we're gonna be fine. Yeah, look at that shield. Hell yeah. Don't you love a bit of good branding? Mm-hmm. Alright, I'm liking this. Like I said, I really like how this design turned out. So swood. I don't know. I might do another one, but I'm just really undecided about it. It looks neat in here, too. I mean, it's not really in here, because, you know, there's no in. I mean, I could make it. Well, kind of. I could put a door here. I could actually put a reinforced door right here. Keep people out. You know, the jerks. All right. It's all done. Now, I, I guess we don't need to get rid of the wicker floor, do we? It's not really hurting anything, and it's not in anybody's way. We just need to rebuild the, uh, the window. And then we're good. Yeah, I could even have that go all the way around if I really wanted to. I don't think I do. But if I wanted to, I could. And then you could put designs all the way on the outside. There you go. Yeah, now it's inside. It's not really inside yet. Well, not yet. Not ever. This will never be considered inside. But it is slightly warmer in here than it is outside, so... Something's working. <laughs> kind of. But yeah, to, to actually block it off, you'd have to do a little bit more. Actually, why don't we have a, a wall here? We should. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. That's not... No wonder. There's like a, a huge gaping hole in the area. That might actually block it off to the point where it's considered a room. Like, what are we doing? I don't want. I don't care about trading right now. Sorry, Stanley. I don't need what you got. And vice versa. Okay, I, I'm more concerned in getting this tower correct. And then we have plenty of other things we still need to do. Like, these trees need to go because they're in my way. 
Get them out of here. If there's any trees over here, get them out of here. We need to get ready to build um, secondary towers up here. And then... I don't know after that. Hey! That's not how I expected the emblems to look. But alright. Cool. I'm still happy to have them. Faithful Sons of England merchants are leaving. Well, goodbye. This is buildable, right? Yeah, it is. Good. Good job, Parish. Back up. 45 skill, by the way. You can pay 45 bills with that. Now it's considered inside. Yeah, now it's nice and warm in here. Cool. Yeah, because it's completely, almost completely roofed. I mean, there's the stairs, but that's okay. Even with the... Even with the doors all open? Yeah, even with all the doors open, it is warm enough in here, as long as you stay off of the stairs. <laughs> Neat. Alright then, we got a proper guard tower. Very cool, very cool. Alright, so... Wow, that was fast. Alright, you guys got it done. Sweet. So, remind me. Overconfidence is a something something we win every time, but also build it out and you go five on each side. Gotcha. Okay. So but that's five. No wait, that's six. No no no. I see I almost goofed it up immediately. It has to be like this, because we go out one extra. Yeah. There you go. Do that. Then double up on it. So we have an idea of what we're doing. Uh, over here, it's going to be a little trickier. Not really. Um, yeah, no. It's this, and then to here. It's like that. It's not really that tricky. There you go. And then one more all the way. Both sides. Beautiful. It's getting a little too cold for some people. Understand. We still have 700 of this stuff. It's getting too cold for a lot of people, actually. We should possibly stop hunting, but I mean, we need the meat. Research is available. We already know how to make the biggest, best shields. I guess we should go for chemistry next. Learn how to make medicine. Seems like a good idea. How's our library looking, by the way? Is it full at the top? Mm, no, not nearly. <laughs> oh, we got a lot more books we can write. Which is good, because once we have enough for all the research, any more books we write are literally just profit. We can sell them. No problems there. Oh, I like how it's lit on the inside. Oh, it, it looks so good. And actually, you know, we should put more... We should put some iron torches on the outside. You know? Uh, oh, right. I put in the... Right. Now oh, they can't get there. Uh, frick. It's kind of a waste of window, but who cares? Honestly, who cares? But yeah, I feel like we should have torches there. We could put, you know, more torches, but I don't know. You could have a torch float. Not nah, space is already occupied. You can't have it float on an oc on an o on an occupied space is what I was trying to say. Ooh, you know what? There's somewhere else I want these tor iron torches. I want it here and here. Yeah. Now you're talking. The torches... Torches are how you, you know... You stake claim the power. You know you're at a powerful position when you got... Iron torches everywhere. There you go. Yeah, get them suckers up. Was it the seventh day of winter? So there's still plenty of... Plenty of wintering to go. Unfortunately. Alright, that's been torn down, so what's the problem? Building can't be reached. That's a lie. That is a lie, and you know it. They can walk here. They know how. They have the technology. It's the technology of using their feet. Tell me where they can and can't walk. Tell me you can get all this built? You can't go up a little, little area? You try the... You're not seriously telling me that this is impossible, right? There's no way. Okay, what? Uh, Alright. 
that works, I guess. I just had to redo it. Apparently. Whatever. Okay, this is almost done. We have so much block too. It's it's like we can't we almost can't afford not to do this. Oh, you know what? I never finished the limestone block floors over here. I need to put in this order too. This is important, you know. Let's you get around this faster, and that's pretty darn important. Yeah, I like it. Ooh, yeah, right there too. Especially the ones here. I like those a lot. Let me just put one right on the Merlon next. I'm kidding. Kind of. Alright. Beautiful. I can tear these down. So that you can actually see the fire, you know? Put the window back in for the third time. <laughs> third time's a charm, right? Yeah, once all the blocks are done, the next step, of course, tearing down these Merlons. And then after that, it's going to be, you know, moving the moat around. The land moat. Which, this one's going to be bigger because they're going to have to get some iron. Uh, speaking of which, how are we doing on iron? 131 iron. You could make a lot more torches with that. Believe it or not. Yeah, now they're working over here, which is good. Uh, a lot of people are cold again. And by a lot of people, I mean Java. Java's cold. It's alright. There you go. Yeah. It's probably could, yeah. That's probably ruined the whole inside motif over here. For now, I don't know. It's still considered inside. It's just it has a hole in it, so it's still considered cold. Gerard's twenty-seven today. Happy birthday to you, dear Gerard, my friend. Yeah. Yes, defenses. Always swing for defenses. A nice little village we got here. Whoa, 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 hey, don't, hey, how did I end up down here? What the hell? <laughs> oh, I wanted to get some good angles to this dangle. Chemistry. Allows us to build the apothecary bench. So we can turn ingredients into cures. So now we can make proper medicine. Which, wouldn't you know it, we have an empty ass room we could use. So we're going to put the apothecary bench in here. This empty ass room. There you go. And then we're gonna what we're gonna need after that are some shelves just for herbs. So shelves. Right here. All right, and we have a lot of herbs. I know this. Wait, no 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 no. Don't don't do this wrongly. Do this rightly. We know how to do it right. You build one you set it up, and then you copy it. That's the right way to do it. We got, we got to make sure we're doing it right. I suppose we could consider putting some beds in here, too, you know? Uh, let's go ahead and actually upgrade the brazier in here to clay brick. Clay brick just looks better. So we'll have one here. We'll have one here. And then, you know, we could put some beds in here. This could be like our little makeshift hospital. Yeah, it'll be great. Or it'll at least be good. Thank you, Java. Love the work you're putting in. Oh, yeah, that window's gonna take a while. Just because everyone's like, I got other things to do now. So, can you actually cut into this or not? Because I'm getting the feeling that you can't. I mean, it says maybe you can. But everyone's like, I gotta get more limestone done first. Priorities, you know? And I know. I know. Lavish meals are deteriorating. That's alright, we got a lot of meat now. So we're going to make some marvelous, magnificent meat meals. You're going to love it. So after the apothecary... Oh, distilling is next. And that's, yeah, that's just... That's just better alcohol. Well, actually it's alcoholic medicinal. Or medicinal alcohol. You know what I meant. Smart lads. <laughs> it's because I said backwards doesn't mean anything settlers are exhausted everyone hold on to your butts who's tired java's tired java you seem to be getting on a lot of a lot of these messages lately 
You're cold, you're tired, you gonna be alright? Alright. Speaking of alright. Simple healing kit. Five herbs, that's it. Let's see. Regular healing kit. Five herbs and three textiles. We actually have plenty of textiles. 1200. And the top one also requires disinfectants. Now that's where we need... Okay, that's where we need the aqua vitae. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. So we can make regular healing kits out the ass. So get us like... 50 regular healing kits. Uh, we should not be putting food on here. Just letting you know. Healing kits. Uh, very high priority. Herbs, the kits, the whole caboodle. I want them up here. Please and thank you. This is where our medicine goes now. Alright. Which means we could take the medicine out of everything else in theory. I mean, we can keep it downstairs. Nah, well, maybe we shouldn't have it downstairs in the stockpile. I'm thinking we could keep it down here, sure. Yeah, the priority down here is low, so we'll move it. It'll get moved automatically up here unless we run out of space up here. And that's kind of how it probably should be. And since I am going to need to be able to make the di distillery? Yeah, the spirit distillery over here. I guess I'm going to have to leave this space open for it. We need two more textbooks and 13 more chronicles. Okay. Good stuff, good stuff. Rise and shine, everybody! It's 5 a.m. Time to party! The partying is actually work, but it's time to do it nonetheless. So get the partying, people! Please, our lavish meals are deteriorating like crazy. It's just normal, but I mean, come on. Alright, Parrish, what you build? Where are you working today? Oh, you got that window done, didn't you? Yep. Like I said, third time's a charm. Keep it open. <laughs> so we can shoot through it. If necessary. And now, because we have a door on here, you know, if they do get up here and breach these doors, we could always retreat into here. Or, you know, this could serve as the distraction point for the trebuchets. I either way, this will work out great for us. I like the, uh, the way that's... Certain areas don't get covered with snow because of the the floor slash roofing. The floor roofing, if you will. You don't have to, but if you will, please. So yeah, now all these just store medicine by default. And look, Bale's already making some medicine. Look at this lab go. What does that actually improve? Uh, it, does that improve your medicine skill directly? It does. Well, that's one good way to train your medicine skill. Oh, that's way better than actually having to, like, work on people. Exotic goods trader. Hey, hey, hey. From the Church of the Third coming. Double hey, hey, hey. Uh, when did Vasilla get a green great helmet? And can I have one? Uh, it looks great. I don't think you're the right person to have it. I'm pretty sure I meant to give that to someone else. That was not you. So, sorry, Vasilla, but I'm going to make you take that off. Alright, as soon as you get upstairs, I'm gonna- what is all of this? Oh, this is from, like, the dead animals, yeah. There you go. Sorry! You have to get yourself a different helmet. This one goes to Melody. 100%. You can have hers if you want, but, uh, Melody needs to be ready to Deus Vault at any time. Even from right here, while she prepares the lavish meal, she must be ready for Deus Vaulting. Look, you don't have to understand our ways. You just have to respect them, okay? Look at that. Where... Oh, yeah, this is... Look at all of our herbs up here. This is great! Yeah! Does this medicine deteriorate? It does, because of temperature. But it, it lasts for 11 days, whereas the herbs will last 28. Ah, crap. <laughs> medicine doesn't last as long as the herbs. But there's an exotic goods trader coming in, and maybe they'd be interested in getting some medicine. Who knows? Let's find out together. Hey there, lads. How we all doing? It's going to be too late by the time you can... Well, no, no, it won't. Plus, Parrish is right here. Parrish, give him a talk. No, don't attack him. Don't attack him. Where's Bumoth? Go, go trade with Bumoth. Alright. 
And they're going downstairs again. They can't help it, man. They just love being down there. Uh, they have textbooks, which I guess you could buy if we really wanted to. Uh, we have healing kits as well. So we can give you some of ours. Since they're going to deteriorate soon. It's better to give those up. I think. Um, Raw meat, lavish meals, stews. Hmm. Limestone brick. Well, what we got? Do you have anything good for us? Like anything I would be interested in? Uh, good wooden spear. Great. Uh, actually, that's ours. What am I talking about? Sell it. Get rid of it. Yeah, get rid of some of this garbage we got. I mean, it's not garbage. It's great stuff. Get rid of it, though. We don't need it right now. Uh, we can start selling some of the winter clothes now that we're nearly, nearly at the tail end of winter. And we can put in orders for making some summer clothing. Foin leather helmet. It's yours, my friend. Yeah, this is a good way to get some cash rolling in. And also, oh god, all these spears. Oh, all these spears. And flails. And flange maces. Take them. Take them. You're going to have better stuff for us, eventually. Uh, we're going to keep our fine steel great axe, but you can take this hatchet. Why not? You might have a better weapon for us, right? Right? Superior iron short swords worth some decent money. Some wooden shields, some flails and spears, fine tower shield, we're going to keep that. Uh, they do not. They have practically nothing in the way of weapons. Well, spoot. <laughs> I hate it. Oh my god, these guys don't have much at all. They have a little bit of mechanical components and some healing kits. Oh my gosh. I guess they just mostly have textbooks, okay. Everything, we've given them like 20 weapons and they're worth 20 textbooks. Man, I love the 14th century. 19 alignment towards them. They loved that. Cool. So that's the kind of trade we need to make with someone else. Except we can't trade everyone else weapons. Well, we can trade them clothing. All right. Carl! Switch summer for winter clothes, please. Make some summer clothes. Yeah, actually, we just have to do like that. Thank you, thank you. Thanks, Carl. Roo, roo, roo yourself, Wolf. I hear you over there. You think so good because it a wolf and you're charming and stuff. Uh, just need two more pieces of limestone brick to be put in, and we'll actually be done with the vertical part of the expansion. Obviously, there is a non-vertical part or portion to it. Which will get done eventually. Roo, roo, roo to you, you, you. Alright? Here, I'll give you something to roo at. Roo this. Roo the day! Ooh, more rabbits. I don't know why there's suddenly all the animals out here, but... I'm not complaining. Ooh, all the animals. All of them! Every single one! What you guys leaving? What are you guys doing? I would think you'd be done for the day. Hey, there goes the snow. Beautiful. Now you can see the road again. Mm-hmm. I feel like I should put something around this to make it look like it just doesn't... Like it doesn't just have a dirt foundation. It looks really weird. Let's try some limestone flooring around it. I think that might help pick it up a bit. You know? I could be totally wrong, and I probably am, but I feel like that'll look a little better. Alright, this side's done with this portion of it. So, up next is the part where we take down the Merlons, of course. Okay. Merlons already down on this side. So I guess we did that backwards, that's okay. It's not that, not that huge a deal. It's just a moderately sized deal. Don't you worry about it. Okay. Next up, we build inward. So, we have this done. So, now it needs to be one, two, th three, four, five in. So, we got one. Oh, come on. Two, 
three, four, five in. And then that would connect there, of course. But for now, we can just go ahead and you know, build around it. All right. And then, of course, we would need to prepare the stairs, which will actually go right there's. There's goes the stairs. Okay. And that side's done too, so we can get ready to go in here. Ah, no. Try that again. Uh, I go for the. Oh, don't. Stop. Oh. Or in. Ooh, this side needs to expand a lot. Do that. And then the stairs, right there's. All right. It's scooting. It's going. It's we're having a good time with it. You get any of the flooring put in over here? We did not. That's all right. We'll get see that flooring get put in eventually. That is going to be it for this episode of that plays uh, going medieval. If you enjoyed it, be sure to let me know by giving a like. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe for more. Because keep coming, we'll stop coming until it's over. And then when it's over, it'll stop coming. That's just how it works. Thanks again for watching this episode of Going Medieval. My name is Thet, and I'll see you in the next video. Everybody, oh, yeah.